too. <laughs> Read the sign. I just kicked the door down. Hey, this is how I knock. Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. Well, come on in, buddy. <laughs> All right, buddy, let's do this. Friend, what? He's a traveler. Weary traveler in search of some hospitality, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Thanks. So, you guys want to play some pool? I want a drink. Anybody else want a drink? Friend, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it. You think I give a fuck what that fucking guy says? Or what you say? No, no, let him. Mixing alcohol right. with drugs is good. Really, you shouldn't drink right now. I can't hear you when you mumble. Swinehart told me that Holly was here. I need to talk to her. Holly's asleep in back, but you won't be able to wake her. Really? Well, the doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal is, if you resist going to sleep <laughs> like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice high. I like Grim he High. He said that he shouldn't mix it with alcohol. I know, let him. It's all good. Yes, he did. He certainly did. But let me tell you something. I haven't felt this good in a long time, fat boy. Have you seen her sister's <laughs> things? What wasn't burned at the funeral? I saw her come in with something, but I didn't see where she put it. Nope, haven't seen it. That funeral back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. Yeah. You weren't fucking there. Talking to Bigby now, okay? Can't say you being there helped things much. Ren, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? I'm not. Right now, I couldn't give a shit what you think. <laughs> no. No? No. Well, I can tell. Whatever. It's all right. I'm too out of it to get into it. I want to clear the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. We're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Fellas, I'm here for one thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, right? yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? And I will. But first, indulge me. It'll take two seconds. As a show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Grand Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. Oh, I could use a drink. Drinking on the job's always a good thing. To the dead. All right, now help me. Oh, he's done. Grand. Doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking gonna warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my back! I said I was sorry, alright? I can't do anything about it, it's done! <laughs> do nothing! Uh, yeah, we should probably do something. <laughs> what more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? Cut this shit out now, I don't care what it's about. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard the news. This walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. And Holly had to find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. <laughs> trick <laughs> after uh, trick. We all got hobbies, right? I didn't plan for that, all right? And our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. 
I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out. And you knew for a damn good fucking reason. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always such a low life. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay, because I'll tell you what he thinks. I think whatever happened was between them, and Lily is dead. So let's put this whole thing to rest, Gray. Grin. I don't know where Lily's shit is. <sighs> Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the role. Maybe, uh, ogres, too. Yeah, we're just gonna say nothing. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. Oh, this is gonna be bad. <laughs> wakey, wakey! <laughs> I just need that box. There we go. <sighs> that you, Woody? Oh, yes, yeah, sure. Woody? Yeah. Sure. Woody, bar's closed. And Lily ain't around anyway, so you can run off back to the woods, I guess. Alright, sounds like a plan. Did you care about her at all? She was a nice girl. Ran around too much. Of course I cared. I still care. I hope so. I hope you do. Lily's funeral. It was just so fucked tonight, but I still wish you could have been there. I just don't know what Bigby's doing, if he, if he cares about it, if he even gives a shit. I don't know. I don't know why he showed up. He cares about this, about Lily, about Faith. I know he does. You think so? Yeah. Well, you know him better than anybody, so... Uh, I guess I'll take your word for it. Who's on the phone? If you were getting your glamour on this day, then one of these has to be the witch. But, which one? Hello, this is Snow White calling. Bigby. Is anyone there? Bigby, if you're there. I'll just ignore her. Snow? Hey, I just wanted to see how it was going. Did you find anything? Just an address book with her contacts initials. Not sure which one is the witch, though. 
strange. These people keep cropping up. Before a few days ago... Any chance you can cross-reference these with the records in the business office? Maybe track her down that way. Yeah, but who knows how long that'll take. You should try going up to Crane's place. I sent Buffkin up there to check on things. Bluebeard, you know. Or you could try at the Tweedle's office. Just make it quick. We don't have a lot of time. The meeting is at two. I'll head over to Crane's apartment, see what I can find there. Sounds good. Just keep me posted. In the meantime, I'll see what I can do on this end. Okay. Good luck, Bigby. We'll find him, Snow. I hope you're right. That way I can piss off Bluebeard. Bluebeard burned everything. I tried to stop him, but I got here too late. He wouldn't listen to me. Threatened to strangle me if I got too close. It's not your fault, Buffkin. I should have come here first. Didn't think Bluebeard would mess things up this badly. Yeah, he's an asshole. Something here I could use to find him. There isn't now. What a waste of fucking time. What now? Did you find any information about the witch at the trip trap? Just this. I don't know which one she is, but it's a start. Maybe I can find more at the Tweedle's office. It's worth a try. I'd better go fill Miss White in on the circumstances. She's going to be very disappointed. Good luck. Who's this guy? Excuse me. Oh, hi. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you remember me. I've, uh... Seen you around, but you may have forgotten. I know who you are, Flycatcher. You've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <laughs> I think I've lost count. But you know, Crane uh, let me go recently. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I mean, it's no big deal. So, what brings you here? I mean, can I help you with anything? Are you here to see one of the brothers? D or Dumb? They, they aren't, they're in here right now. I'm not sure when they'll be back. You seen Crane around? Not around here. I saw him leave the woodlands earlier, but I'm not supposed to bother him. I don't really think he likes me. It's been uh he doesn't like quite anybody. Night so far. I think the twins are out, probably working on a case. Sometimes I don't see them for days. They gave me the job after Crane told me to get lost. Where's their office? Oh, right this way. I, I was going there next anyway. I can let you in if you want. You can wait for them there. Sure, thanks. No problem. I'm gonna have to take a look around. Uh, well, I, I guess that would be okay. I wasn't really asking for permission. Oh, I was literally right. just gonna You're say the that. Sheriff. I just don't want to get in trouble or anything. I'm sure it's fine. I mean, they never told me not to let you in. Don't worry. I won't get you in trouble, right? Right. Oh, I'm gonna get you in trouble. Dear Brother Dumb, I hate dogs and you know it. Sincerely, Brother D. What's that about? They do have their quirks. Ah. Dear Brother D, I think we should get ourselves a dog. Sincerely, Brother Dumb. Couple of freaks. <laughs> <sighs> this is pointless. I, I know these guys can come off abrasive at times, but they aren't so bad once you get to know them. Yeah, they, they shot really at me with a shotgun. 
They're kind of loud at times, but you get used to it. I guess they have to be, in their line of work. They only care about helping criminals. No, I think you've got the wrong idea. They help all kinds of people. They're detectives. Anyone can come in here with a problem and they'll do their best to fix it. The way Dee explains it, it's like if someone lost their cat, well, they could hire them to, you know, track it down. Or like sometimes, they get packages for people. They can be like couriers, you know? For who? All kinds. Come to think of it, I don't really know where they keep them. Oh, we're gonna Anyways, find I'm it. just saying, you just don't know them like I do. Sure, flycatcher. Why well, when they shoot you with a shotgun, you tell me how good of a guy is there. You know about this? Nah, no. I just take it. Let's see if they've got a file on a crane. Ichabod Crane. He owes the crooked man money. Shit. How is he planning to pay this all back? Request for property acquisition. Further details filed under donkey skin. Crane hired them to look for a photo? Why did he want it back so badly? So that's why they were at her apartment, and the woodsman's place. See, I knew you wouldn't find anything. Anything of interest, anyways. They're, they're detectives, like I said. Just, just trying to make an honest living. I haven't found anything yet. I'm just saying. Look, just trust me on this. Tweedledee and Dumb are not nice. They're not helping anyone. Well, they helped me. Okay, great, they helped you. It's one person. Now, please, just let me concentrate here. What do they got on beauty? <laughs> this is worse than I thought. Shit. Detective Brannigan? Keep an eye on her. Yeah, that chick was weird. Find anything? Not what I need. W what, if, what if you're wrong about them? I'm not. They're misunderstood, sure, but that doesn't mean everything people say about them is true. I mean, you know, like when I think about it, you guys aren't that different. You help people, and they help people. Is that what you think? Bigby? Shit. There's something here. I know there is. There has to be. Why would there be anything because to- Because they're lying to you, okay, Flycatcher? That's why. They aren't detectives. They're somehow involved in the murders, Flycatcher. Two fables are dead. Bigby, what happened to your... They shot me. You wanna know what this is? This is them showing up to Lily's funeral with fucking shotguns! I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I I, I... I didn't know. Holly and Grant both got injured. Snow White nearly got her head blown off. Do you get it now? I didn't mean to... There's a door behind this file cabinet. I don't know what they keep back here, but it might be what you're looking for. Well, that key you found should work. You couldn't have told me that in the first place? Oh, we going down in the cellar. Wow. 
Hold for BCW. Hm. What are you looking for exactly? Maybe I can help. Anything about Crane. Or the witch he was using. Something. J.D. This doesn't really tell us much. You didn't even look in the book. Butcher. What is this stuff? Hell if I know. I'm sorry, I know I'm late. I'll get it to you soon. Ichabod Crane. Who was he sending money to? Crooked man. Care of the lucky pawn. You know what that is? <laughs> Take the money. <laughs> Just steal everybody's money. Is that what you needed? I don't think so. But it's interesting. There's more going on here. I still need to find that witch, though. Hey, Big B. Do you think, after all this, do you think I could come back to the woodlands? Since Crane let me go, I mean, I can still work here, but I don't think I want to now. I don't <laughs> want to work with bad people, you know? You should talk to Snow. Maybe there's something she can do for you. Really? That would be... thank you. It's Snow's hair. Snow White? Why w We found her hair like this inside Lily's glamour. Anti-Greenleaf. This must be the witch Crane was using. I guess Dee and Dumb were getting the hair for Crane and sending it to her? That's not a pleasant thought. Anti-Greenleaf. A.G. It's gotta this be the one. It. Should I tell someone? How oh, about shit. Miss White? I wasn't quick enough. Have her meet me there. 